grade 5 students. Have a wonderful day today. So what did we see in our last class? Very good. We saw a poem, right? Yes. So today we are going to have a recap of our last poem. So what was the poem about? Very good. A bird. So can you name the bird? Skylark. Very good. So what type of bird is Skylark? Excellent. So, a skylark can sing as it is flying. Excellent. So, let us move on. So, who is the poet here? Yeah, Christina Georgiana. Christina Georgiana is the person who has written this poem. And they are called the author or poet? Very good. So, she is the poet. Now, the earth was green, the sky was blue. I saw and heard one sunny morn, a skylark hang between the two, a singing speck above the corn. So what is happening here in this poem? We see that the poet starts with a beautiful day. She is describing the nature. She is saying that it is a beautiful sight. The earth is fully green, the sky is blue, and it is a beautiful day and what she can hear she can hear a lovely uh, voice so it is the voice of the skylark and then what happens so as she is listening to it she starts walking among the cornfields so the bird is hanging among the cornfields that is it's trying to fly high among the cornfields so the poet gets up and she hears that voice and she starts following it. She starts following among the millions of corn stalk. So as she's walking, 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 walking. So suddenly she pauses at one place. Why she does so? Because as the day is moving away slowly, she can hear this pleasant voice also vanishing. So what happens? So the poet says that more than herself, she has been taken over with this beautiful sound. So more than this, she says that more than herself, that the bird's mate, bird's mate means the bird's partner, would have been listening to this beautiful uh, voice of the skylark for more time. So this is the poem and it's a very wonderful poem. So what is alliteration? Last class, ma'am told you, no? So, what is alliteration? So, ma'am will give you an example. So, now ma'am is writing here a line from the poem. Silent, silent, sank, and sold. S-O-A-R-E-D. So, can you... Uh, Tell me what are the alliterated words? Yes, the beginning sounds, the S. Silent, sank and soul. So these are alliterations. The beginning sound will be the same in the starting word or the adjustant words. So maybe this or this or from the beginning word of a sentence. Okay, so these are called alliterations. Now, next, now coming to what is the meaning of speck? So I told you, you know, speck. So the bird was flying like a speck over the cornfields, right? So what is this? Now in this whole white space, just look at it, the whole white space, I have put a speck. Excellent, a spot. So a speck means spot. So I hope you are clear with the poem. And today your homework will be page number 48 so page number 48 from your workbook please complete your homework take a pic and send it to ma'am before 7 p.m in the evening and again so please do what very good so your handwriting practice so you got to practice your handwriting at home start learning new words from the dictionary and coming to your GK question. So which mammal can fly? So find out the answer and tell it to ma'am in the next class. Take care students and be safe. Bye.